right leo this is going to be your new versus i'm reading for um may uh if you don't resonate with this look back in the leo playlist at that new versus i'm reading because there's some in there um otherwise download your birth chart astro.com and uh, check out your other signs your moon can be good for love and also for a female look at your venus for a man look at your mars or but look at them both anyway yeah right leo let's go uh yeah if you could like and share this video that'd be good and subscribe if you haven't already if you have thank you i appreciate that a lot right leo sun yeah me and leo rising <laughs> someone wants to talk <laughs> right let's go I'll read the energy from the bottom, okay? So, Leo, you could be dealing with a, the mother of your children or a Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. Yeah, uh, it could be someone, yeah, I'm not seeing a King of Pentacles, so I don't, I'm not saying someone you're married to. Somebody could be looking at, um, they could see you as healing. They could also see that you've healed, maybe, because there you are, Leo. Um, yeah, maybe you had to, maybe you were pouring your own love away for a certain amount of time. You had to heal, you had to find your happiness, maybe. Yeah, after great sadness, maybe. You had new ideas. You've got the truth of the situation and you've got victory by that. And that could have been around the Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, King of Swords. Somebody who had good intuition, yeah. And an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, but normally my Aries cards. And this person can be a bit of a chameleon. They can change up when they want to. They also had three sprigs on their, on their wand, if that's what I think. Yeah, it could have been a soulmate relationship at some point. Partnership, soulmate. Two of Cups normally is. But maybe you need some secrets and one was a high priestess or there was a Pisces involved. Yeah, and could have been a Gemini. Could have been a choice between two lovers. Maybe somebody chose somebody. Maybe somebody made a commitment to somebody. But there were secrets kept about this. And there was a lot of drama around the situation. There had to be a complete ending. Could have been a Scorpio. But there had to be a change of a transformation of the situation. So the wheel of death. So the wheel of fortune. The wheel of destiny could. Yeah. Could turn. That could have involved a lot of money. And it could have been from support. People that should be support. People from your past. People from your childhood. Maybe you were given a vision of a situation, yeah, spiritually given a vision. Could have been wisdom. You could have gained some wisdom from an emperor. You could have gained some wisdom from an Aries or a father figure. Yeah, about some challenges that were around you, about maybe a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. Some of you had to take independence from maybe because of uncertainty and trust issues, yeah. Or, yeah, you had to take action on that situation. Someone could have been being very generous. With some money, there's a lot of money now coming out. Uh, yeah, comfort, like single energy, but also comfort, money, comfort, generosity, action, and comfort. And there was a lot of determination. Maybe you kept going back to something, something where there was an indifference and love, somewhere where you could have been calmly tied to, could have been a cup of cool, but it's a devil. You had to break free from a situation, yeah, and take preparation. Of your dreams even, maybe, Leo. Or some illusions and lies, something you were sleeping on. Maybe you had to make progress forward, make a choice. Find peace in life again. Find a balance in life and get control back over your life, maybe. So you could become you, Leo. Creativity, yeah. Find your luck again, yeah. Work out where your friendships were. Had to isolate from a lot of people, maybe. And had a lot of restrictions. But it was also you could have a new beginning in love. And a new beginning with abundance. Have a resolution to these situations so you could move away from them so you could get your recognition and reward drop these burdens 
get new inspiration. Yeah, you were tested, Leah. You had to make a departure from situations to say you could have a new beginning. That's why you had these tower moments in your life so you could have enlightenment. Find integrity. Yeah, maybe from players or players in your life. Could have been a Sagittarius, but it could have just been players. Somebody was a cheater. Yeah, people that you were a blessing to or they were a blessing to you. Some people had a lot of choices or you've got a lot of choices coming. Could have been a Gemini involved. There could have been a lot of juggling going on in the situation. There could have been some magic going on in the situation as well. Yeah, and somebody was very dedicated to that. Yeah, maybe you felt guidance to move away. Maybe you felt guidance about a theft that was going on as well around you, Leo, or to you. Yeah, gather your strength again, your courage. Um, and take freedom from the situation, have endings with these people. You could have a Cancer Pisces or Scorpio coming in with some commitment, who's ended some cycles maybe, had a prophecy, been in the hangman for a while, maybe they want to come in. Uh, you could also have a King of Pentacles who's coming in, maybe you had a loss with that person. Yeah, on a home situation, so you could have like, yeah. There you go, Leo. <laughs> right. We'll go by them through them. By them. We'll go through them one by one and uh, clarify. Right. First card we've got is shining a light on the situation. Card of Virgo the Hermit. And those cards just fell on the floor, so I can't ignore them. You could have psychically known about other people in the background, that's the other woman card. Yeah, you could have been loyal to somebody. Yeah, you had to cut them out of your life, basically. Um, pushing dark clouds over the light clouds. And it could have affected your family, your home. Maybe that's what you had to take a reflection on, Leo, and see something. Um... <laughs> yeah, right. So the mental state on this relationship for you is judgment and they've got, well their mental state is they've got an emperor somewhere who, if you're not pregnant Leo, then somebody is over there. Yeah. Hmm. On this relationship from the past, yes, yeah, somebody who stabs you straight through the heart, the will of fortune is not turning on that situation, it's not moving forward. So I'm assuming you're single at this time, Leo. Because <laughs> that's just, yeah, what it is, really. Um, what else does Leo need to know on this judgment from the past? Somebody could be having twins as well, so yeah. Yeah, maybe you had there was a lot of fighting going on, maybe a lot of arguments, maybe a lot of situations in your head. You could have been fighting with like five different people as well. It couldn't have might not have just been one person. And it was over a cup of love. You seem to be guarding that cup of love now. Your new beginning with love, you're guarding that very, very tightly. Yeah. Yeah. Uh you could have a knight of pentacles coming in very, very slowly. Somebody who had some sneaky behaviour and they've got themselves stuck now where they could have, Whatever way they go, they're stuck because they're going to, if they move, they they stab themselves in the throat, basically. So basically, that yeah, let's find out what there is. Abundance is the Empress. The very pregnant Empress, yeah. And my cards are in reverse. Yeah, there's a tower moment going on around this Empress situation at the moment. There's a spaceship coming. It's already blown one person out. One person's lying on the floor and the other person's now going out. What's that all? Yeah, this tower moment could have happened because uh, I've uh, a father figure, an Aries or a older businessman entrepreneur anyway somebody somebody's brought down a tower um somebody could have a capricorn or a devil under control at this moment as well and yeah and they've got a, a big cobra going all the way around them they could have been spying online on somebody or on something yeah could have had something to do with you leo because you're there the queen of wands um 
yeah some of these become enlightened but they were hanging upside down and maybe for a little while they were crying over some spilt milk but now they're looking at what they've their ship's coming in, they've connected with something, with some new sprigs, got their hand on their chin, like having a good think about something. And the moon seems to be shining a light on the situation, so it could be a cancer. That's on your person side, that's on their mental state. This moment says it's a big tower and they were going on over there and it could be over a pregnancy. Yeah, Leo, you've got the Eight of Wands, which can be messages. Um, so you could be getting some messages coming in, but in your emotions, you're on a new journey. I see by that. You're on a journey anyway. Your person over there, <laughs> in their emotions, they want, on this relationship, they want a celebration with a Three of Cups. Yeah, you're in high priestess and they'd say you know secrets. You've got your hands crossed as well, like the devil might be coming in to get you. Yeah. Landed in reverse. So. Yeah, I feel like you've you've already been pushed like she it come out in reverse, but the right way up it's eight of swords, so it um it's a seven of swords. It's an eight of swords, so yeah, it's normally it's normally blindfolding yourself to a truth, but this one is about to fall backwards, maybe and it come out in reverse. I feel like you're not falling for that again, maybe. I've got a strange feeling. <laughs> yeah, maybe you knew somebody was working on something. They could have even been working on you, but yeah, there's definite one night stand energy, there's a pregnancy, there's a baby. If the baby's not already born, the baby's about to be born. In your emotions, Leo, you already know that you've got the high priestess. Yeah, you could be dealing with a cancer, you don't have to be, but if you've got on your chariot and you've moved away from the situation, maybe you, you kind of have a little look <laughs> just before you disappear off. But one more. Yeah, the moon card. Somebody had somebody dancing by the moon. They were on strings to the moon as well. These illusions and lies. Somebody had somebody dangling by some strings. I don't know if there is. There's heavy cancer. You could have heavy cancer in your chart as well. Yeah. Let's do um, this person wanting to celebrate with you. It could be a king of pentacles. Would you have had that in the beginning, Virgo? A toss of Capricorn. Yeah, this person's getting judgment and it's on a child. There's a child being born over there. See, someone's got their hand on their head, somebody's praying, and somebody's holding the baby, and there's judgment being called on that situation. So, that pregnancy over there, and I think it's being hidden from you at this time, Leo, yeah, but it's about to come out. Yeah, caught from somebody going around acting single. Yeah, somebody could have a dog, somebody could. Could have been around money as well, a lot of money above that person's head, so maybe that was a slight thing as well, but it's a judgment in a situation. Yeah, somebody's got their guard up as well, maybe somebody's waiting for you to come in and find out about the situation, they're probably going to have a little, little freak out, they don't realise you already know, yeah. This person may come in and offer you some money, yeah. Like they're going to be hiding a lot of money behind their back as well. Like a lot of money behind their back. Or someone they're involved in, there's some money being hidden behind their back. And somebody's going to offer somebody a pentacle. And they've got lots of pentacles behind their back. Somebody's biting their fingers off with the letter as well at this time. Like with worry, with stress, they're up at the night time. They're not dealing with things so great yet. Right, what your person has to offer you, Leo, is heartache at this time, and what you have to offer them is sensitivity. I feel like you're not in the water at all, you've controlled your emotions, you've got your hand over your couple of, you're looking over them, and they look to me like they're in heartache, yeah. Yeah, you're looking back, Leo, and you're off to go and have a new beginning. <laughs> Jumping around lots of fish, but I think the fish are over there, yeah. You're having a new beginning, blossoming up in your empress energy, and you're looking, you're looking at that new beginning. You're looking in a different direction, like you're sensitive to the situation over there. I don't feel like you're even being like horrible about it. I feel like you just, it's just done. Yeah, blossoming up in your own energy with a strength card there. Oh, you were just, yeah, family situation. You're looking after your own family, or you're blossoming up and moving on from us, aren't we? Oh. 
Yeah, someone put a spanner in the works of the situation and made you look, and it could have been something to do with money as well. Maybe somebody enlightened you to a lot of things. That, yeah. But I feel like the pregnancy over there is, is going to be a big deal, yeah. This person, they're heartbroken. Could be from the mother of their children, from being a player maybe. They've got a mother of the children from being a player. Yeah, they've, they slept on something. <laughs> and they ended up getting stabbed right through the, through the whatever, yeah. I've got a feeling the person they've had a baby with, they're not even on the good terms. It's not even someone they want to have to deal with, but now they have to deal with it. And this is what happens when you mess around with things you shouldn't be messing around with and <laughs> bring out the genie, yeah. Wherever that comes from. And there's not just these two people, there's another person, because in that, in that, um, I can't remember what card it was, it was over there. There was a man, a woman, and an older woman. So somebody's praying, maybe. Maybe somebody's praying this baby isn't who they think it is, but it is who they think it is, yeah. And this has got something to do with somebody. It could be a Gemini involved as well. But somebody doing something, somebody manifesting something, but not just manifesting, doing some magic, and it's what that, that's what happened, yeah. <laughs> and that's karma, yeah. Somebody was trying to sneak away with some money as well. I think somebody was trying to get away with something else and they made something else happen and it's going to make, it's going to be, it's not just a little thing, it's a big thing and it's going to affect, yeah, a lot of people probably. You're going to hear about this, Leo. Yeah, some cards going to affect a lot of people. Your happiness is going to affect a lot of people as well. Because these people tried to stop that and, yeah. You're fearing, Leo, you're not going to get your blessing, but you are about to get your blessing. You're going to get some keys, maybe some keys to a house or something, but there's some blessing coming in. You're going to be dancing under the sun once again, yeah. The world, the end of all these cycles that have been going on, this, this, yeah. And it could be on the Ten of Cups, on a family situation. Got the world card then the ten of cups could be on a family situation so that all over there could be on a family situation yeah the person over there is worried about gossip so worried about what you know already they're already arguing with somebody somebody's getting very drunk putting their hands in their ear they don't want to hear the truth but the truth's coming out and they think you've already heard from gossips there so you're about to hear about this pregnancy that's happened and this is somebody, it could even be somebody in your family. Yeah, the nine of swords, the overall energy is stress, yeah, and then we've got that card of somebody hiding some money in a tree. It's the end of this backfighting, this person sticking their tongue out at you thinking they've won up to you or other lots of people doing that. Yeah, somebody wants to come in with an apology maybe, but you're walking away, you put your hands up, you're walking away from the situation. Yeah, somebody could also be shutting children up at this time from what they know and what they don't know. Someone's basically skating on very, very thin ice at this time. Yeah, and that could be a Cancer Pisces or Scorpio could be involved in that. Somebody who's got choices at this time as well. Somebody also is trying to sneak away from a situation maybe. Yeah. Yeah, there's no more juggling though, whatever that was going on and these three people working on each other or, or working in conjunction to work on. Yeah. Somebody's on... Yeah, somebody's commitment as well is like somebody's knees are knocking now. Somebody's worried about everything. Yeah. And they're trying to hide this fish in the cup, which is a pregnancy, in in their pocket so no one sees. Somebody's trying to do a runner at this time. They're getting in their ship and making them evil. Somebody's coming over to try and sort out the situation, maybe. Could be a king of swords. Could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Somebody whose child holds... The world at this time yeah then maybe it's going to cause a ten of swords a complete ending to the situation somebody who also wants to have a new beginning with stability or they're guarding that like a dragon right now yeah that could be a gemini legal aquarius somebody could be getting a divorce at this time as well or they're about to yeah over a soulmate relationship as a, you see she's pregnant there as well yeah somebody's going to end up literally like crying at the bottom of the stairs 
could be a Capricorn with the devil card there. Somebody was acting devilish. Somebody tickled somebody under the chin and somebody got pregnant. <laughs> if that's the way it goes down, yeah. And basically, it's going to cause somebody to do some healing they've already done. But I feel like you've already done that healing. Yeah, that's justice in the situation here. On this show, somebody thought they were constructing the whole show. Maybe they didn't realise, but you kind of chose your own thing. You dropped these burdens on this lovers, this Gemini. Uh, or somebody's choice between two lovers. Somebody had some fun, but I don't feel like it ended that way. It could have been a Virgo, but somebody's literally screaming in, in regret. <laughs> Balance needed in this situation, yeah. And somebody, somebody's going to come in and speak this truth very, very sharply. It could be an Aries coming to speak it about a third party situation, a party that was going on, but the party went wrong, yeah. And somebody's cut all communication and that. And it could have been over a lot of money, but people were taking gambles, taking bets, doing things. There's somebody with a voodoo doll in the situation as well underneath the table. Yeah, you need to keep your guard up from these people. Yeah, it could be a Cancer Pisces or Scorpio. Somebody's cups are literally dripping with, with yeah, dripping now. Empty and out. Somebody, yeah, uh, somebody's come out of this being indecisive. You could look at surprise the Scorpio coming towards you, who's come out of being indecisive. But yeah, anyway, Leah, I'm gonna leave it there. Take care, yourselves. Love you. Bye bye.